I'm Isaiah. Good morning, Bears. We are reporting live from RHD. Today is Friday, February 9th. It is the 96th day of school. Today is National Pizza Day. The time is 7.53. Now to Tyler. Hi, I'm Tyler. Please pause and join us in a moment of silence. Please stand and join us to say Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now to Addie with our birthday report. Hi, I'm Addie. Several students had birthdays this week when school was closed. Happy birthday to Colin Briggy, Kayla Blue, Kayla Libby, and Henry Schofler and Nicholas Foxit. And happy birthday! Yay! And we have two students celebrating a birthday over the weekend. Happy birthday to Peyton Lowers and Owen Nelson. Happy birthday! Now to Jackson with breaking news. Hi, I'm Jackson. The National Weather Service began on this day in 1870. The National Weather Service is part of the United States government. It provides weather forecasts and warnings of hazardous weather. The National Weather Service also provides information on how to stay safe during hazardous weather. Not to Isaiah with breaking news. Today is the start of the 23rd Winter Olympics. They are being held in South Korea. There are 92 countries participating in the Olympics with almost 3,000 athletes and 102 total events. Four athletes were born in Virginia. They will participate in bobsled, hockey, skiing, and speed skating. Not a Mr. T with our Olympic Winter Olympic Minute. Next week we'll be talking more about those four Virginians uh, who are participating in the Olympics. One of them is from Ashburn, Virginia. He's on the men's hockey team. Uh, starting Monday, we'll start. We'll do. We'll talk a little bit about him, and then we'll talk about the other Virginia athletes. Also, we want to let you know that Pyeongchang, South Korea, where the Olympics are being held, right now they're on a different time frame than us. In Pyeongchang, right now it is 9.30 at night. They are 13 and a half hours ahead of what we are here in Virginia. Today's uh, Olympic events, if you were to go home tonight, is the opening ceremonies. But also today there are curling events. USA Curling plays today. There are snowboard events and... Uh, alpine skiing. So if you're into snowboarding, alpine skiing, or curling, tonight try to find some of those events on TV. Back to you, Isaiah. Nada Tyler with more news. Now to Mr. T to introduce the Watchdog Dads. So give us a minute. We have two Watchdog Dads with two children coming in here. We love our Watchdog Dads. So when you guys see them in the halls, please tell them thanks for coming. It's so awesome to have these guys in the building with us. Today we have... Uh, Matt Lowers and my son Peyton and Mrs. Ship's class. And we also have uh, Jason Phillips and this is my son Sid and Mrs. Nelson's class. So guys, when you see them in the lunchroom or in your classroom, please don't thank you. We love having our watchdog dads. Thanks guys. Thank you. Cardio means hot. It's short for cardio basketball or cardio respiratory. Cardio is a form of aerobic exercise that raises your heart rate and makes your heart stronger. Cardio respiratory endurance is a component of fitness that means the heart and lungs work together as a team to supply oxygen to the working muscles over a long period of time. Can you think of any sports or physical activities that work on cardio respiratory endurance? Thank you. Now to our meteorologist for today's weather forecast. Good morning. This is meteorologist Harley from Miss Jill's room with your weather report. Today we are expecting to have a partly cloudy day. The chance of precipitation is 0%. The high temperature will be around 46 degrees. Be prepared to wear a jacket and long pants when you go outside today. Thank you. Now to Mrs. O'Hara with our bear down windows. <laughs> Good 
Good morning, boys and girls. I am so excited that we actually have been in school for two whole days. Are you tired? No. Yeah. Well, you know, we have an incentive going on right now through PBIS, and we have to spell the, the word game. Well, we have two letters for it. So, next week and today, we have to get the last two letters so we can have our game days next week. So, teachers, give out those pink bear paws, and kids, you've got to be showing those respectful behaviors. Okay, I have two teachers. Drum roll, please. Okay, these two teachers need to come see me for gift cards. Mrs. Weems and Mrs. Mackey. Congratulations. Okay, four Bears Den winners of the week. I'm going to skip around today. You know, it's Friday. Let's mix them up. What grade should we do first today? Kindergarten. Jackson. Fifth. 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 All right. From Mrs. Stein's class, we have Haley Grimes. Should we do third grade this time? Yeah. Yeah, let's change it up. In third grade, from Mrs. Serma's class, we have Daniel McConnell. Congratulations. In first grade, we have, from Mrs. Owens' class, Chloe Smith. In kindergarten, we have, from Mrs. Reinhardt's class, Rowan Green. In fourth grade, I'm going to mix it up, we have Mrs. Jewel's class, Karma Bugnosen. And last but not least, from second grade, from Mrs. Groff's class, we have Noella Matiti. Okay, you guys need to come down and have your picture taken. Please join us to recite our daily pledge. Today I will do more than I have to do. I will treat others as I want to be treated, and I will try to become a better person. What are the three R's? Responsible, respectful, and ready to learn. Have a fabulous Friday. Remember, manners matter.